Hey guys, today's video is actually a request. I had a request for this uh, several months ago. I just ain't never had a chance to make a video on it. This is a 19 and a half horsepower post twin Briggs. So you got one cylinder over here and one cylinder here, and these are both flathead cylinders. And uh, so this ain't a V twin. This is a post twin, or more commonly known as a boxer style engine. And each piston moves like this. This is a model 46 and it's a 19.5 horsepower and this video is going to be talking about all the linkages on it and uh, we'll start with the choke because it's going to be the most simplest on this you see I got a spring hooked up on this choke to keep it open and the only reason for that is because I didn't have a I just had it sitting on a test frame I didn't have a choke cable hooked up but your choke cable would hook up here and you set your choke to off and it'd be all the way down here and when you pull the choke it closes the choke plate like that and that's how that works and uh, if you see this other spring down here that was temporary because uh, the spring or something got in the bind on this and it kept running wide open I had to put that spring on there to keep it from doing that so that uh, spring shouldn't be on there and this uh, I got an angle on this screw right here where you're throttle cable would go and it would run down here and hook to this hole right here and it would pull it up like that this adjustment here on this bolt adjusts the tension on your governor spring which you can see right there and it runs down and hooks onto that arm right here you can see right there it's actually supposed to be in that hole right there not on the side that's probably why it was running so fast that's probably all that's wrong with it I got other videos on how to adjust the governor. You do that here with this tightening bolt and your adjustment here on the shaft that goes down inside the engine. And from your governor arm, you get this arm right here. It runs up to the, the plastic plate here. And another short linkage that runs to your throttle plate on the carburetor. This is your idle speed adjustment screw here. This particular carburetor is the four bolt type and this one has no adjustment screws on it. No fuel mixture adjustment screws. You can see how the uh, all your throttle is supposed to be on this. Like I said, forget about this spring, it's not supposed to be there. And uh, that adjustment screw is like uh, if this engine was on a generator you could adjust this to tune the govern speed on it. And there's also another spring over here. It's gonna be kind of hard to see on the video. That's right here. It's the govern idle speed spring here. And uh, your idle speed can, this is the, sets the lowest speed that the engine will idle at. You can bend this tab in or out to adjust the govern idle, idle speed. I never did think too much of the governed idle, just something else that goes wrong on them. Which that, this could be out of adjustment, which was causing it to run wide open, which is why I had to put that spring on there. But uh, yeah, this is mainly talking about the, the linkages and everything and uh, how all that goes. Like I said, the, the simplest part on this engine is the choke. And you notice there's three holes in there. You just, it depends on how. Uh, how much of your choke cable moves, your choke control. If it just moves a little bit, you can use that small one. If it got more more pull on it, you can use that other one. This type uh, doesn't have an automatic choke. I've never seen one with an automatic choke. It's always been a manual choke on these. And it's not like the single cylinder engines. But, but yeah, that's, uh, that basically gives you an idea of how all the... Uh, governor linkages, throttle linkages, and choke linkages are set up on this uh, particular type of engine. And all the opposed twins are going to be very similar to this. There are different carburetors and uh, slightly different uh, adjustment throttle uh, linkages, but all your main linkages are going to be basically the same or very close to this. And uh, So yeah, if you got any questions or comments about the opposed twin throttle linkages, let me know and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. So thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.